This is chamomile. It's often lovingly referred to as the grandmother herb. How many times have you taken your problems or your woes, your pain, your sorrows to your grandmother and they just, she knew exactly what to say and exactly what to do to help you feel better. In a strange way, this plant chamomile does the same thing. My name is Maria Chaudhry, and I'm a midwife and an herbalist and the creator of Birth Song Botanicals. And I want to take a moment out to send a moment of appreciation and gratitude to all the grandmothers and all the wisdom keepers and herbal traditional keepers that have carried on the tradition of herbal medicine so that we can share it today. I'm working on a series of videos right now all about stress relief and anxiety relief. And I'm talking to you about a classification of herbs called nervines. Nervines are any type of herb that can stimulate the central nervous system and has any effect on the central nervous system. So you can have stimulating herbs, you can have tonifying herbs, and you can have relaxing nervines. A stimulating nervine would be something like caffeine, right, or coffee, tea, matcha, or a tonifying herb could also be like an adaptogen, or a tonifying herb is going to nourish and strengthen the central nervous system. And then we have relaxing nervines, and these relaxing nervines Chamomile is one of them, and they tend to relax the central nervous system. What they do is they take all this when we feel we're like we're overwhelmed and we're out there. It takes all this and it brings it into our center line, to our central nervous system. And then we feel more grounded and quieter and softer and centered. Chamomile helps do that. I just did a whole series about anxiety and stress and the nervine, so I encourage you to watch that series. One thing I wanna say about us as people, we tend to have a problem, right? And we have, that means I'm stressed, I have a symptom. So I want to solve that symptom. So I look for, I read about an herb that can potentially solve this symptom and I, take it okay solid and serene stress and anxiety support okay this is for me this will help my symptom and then we just try to solve the symptom where i'm trying to propose that we vitalize the entire system and then those symptoms will be resolved herbs tend to do more than one thing right chamomile yes is a relaxing nervine it's also an antispasmodic herb. What that means is it helps reduce the spasms or tension in your muscles. So you can have overuse of muscles, you ran too far or you worked out, did too many push-ups and you feel tense, or you have tension in your shoulders from stress, or you have menstrual cramps, or you just pushed a baby out, you have postpartum afterbirth cramps, or you're incredibly nervous because you're public speaking and your abdomen is tight and you have nervousness and you have cramps in your abdomen for that, chamomile can help relieve all that pain. It can also help pain relief in another way is because it's anti-inflammatory. So it can help your joints. So when your joints are inflamed, you hurt and it's hot. Chamomile is cooling and anti-inflammatory and it helps soothe pain for people that suffer from arthritis, right? And so when you have cramps that are hurting you or joint pain or muscle pain or tension, all of that becomes stressful and that amplifies your response to stress, making it worse. Chamomile is also highly nutritive, right? So. A big part of a person that lives a very stressful life is they're depleted. Chamomile is high in calcium. And another benefit, not only of its nourishment, but if you drink tea, then you're hydrated. 
And a person that's maxed out, they tend to not eat well, and they tend to not stop and drink enough. They wait till they're really thirsty before they get a drink. And when someone is in this state of fatigue and anxiety and stress, they're always overworking. And so they almost need more nourishment than other people. They need more hydration than other people. So chamomile, drinking chamomile tea is a reminder to hydrate and nourish yourself. Also in my practice, I'm a midwife, right? And so a lot of people come to me because they have problems breastfeeding. So they are completely stressed out and have tons of anxiety associated around their ability to feed their baby. Chamomile tea helps support them in a few ways. One, because it helps them digest their food. And another way, it's going to hydrate and nourish them. And then another way, it's going to calm them and bring them to their center. And when they bring them to their self to their center, they can relax and then the milk can flow. I always say, let your love and your milk flow. Chamomile helps that happen. Hmm. We incorporate chamomile in a lot of our products, in, re in our breastfeeding teas, in our cycle relief for soothing menstrual cramps, and solidly serene to help you when you feel pulled in multiple directions to find your center. In children's tranquility, I'll do a whole uh, segment on that, but children's tranquility is for the baby that has a lot of pain. Partially they have pain because they're growing. They have growing pains, they have teething pains, they are, their life is changing. We think children, oh, it's just so easy for them, but they actually have a lot of stress in their life. Children's tranquility is helpful for that. We also have it in good night because chamomile can help you rest and sleep. And it's one of the well-known, well-studied, there's multiple studies all about how chamomile can help you sleep through the night. And nurtured mother. Nurtured mother is for the woman that just pushed her baby out. She's feeling postpartum. She might have the blues. She might feel anxious and stressed about being a mother. She might be stressed about um, making enough milk and she might also be in a lot of physical pain from her uterine contractions and from her body she just used every muscle in her body to push her baby out and so chamomile is going to help support her for that hmm. there's so much more to say about chamomile and nervines so I encourage you to watch the other videos but if you've enjoyed this video I encourage you to push like and subscribe and share it with your friends. You can find us, Birth Song Botanicals, on Facebook. You can find us on YouTube, on SoundCloud. And for more apothecary wisdom, I encourage you to just come right back here. We've got a lot more to share with you. And until then, I encourage you to drink deep. And I mean herbal tea. I'm drinking chamomile tea right now. And water. Drink deep and always walk in beauty.